Hey peeps, welcome back to another video. My name is Beauty Body Unity. If you're new, hi. If you are viewing on a mobile device, click the subscribe button here. If you're viewing on a desktop device, click the, click the subscribe, but the subscribe button here. Today, I'm going to be talking to you guys about a perfect eyeshadow. Like when I say perfect eyeshadow, this eyeshadow is just everything or eyeshadows because I'm going to talk about more than one. Three. These eyeshadows are very, very perfect and they're from the drugstore and they are highly, highly slept on in my opinion. But these are great eyeshadows and I just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit and kind of share with you guys what they are about. I've already done a review of these eyeshadows and the palette itself so it's on my channel. So if I don't have a link below it'll be on my channel but I will try my best to have a link below. This is from Ruby Kisses which is very affordable and these are their eyeshadows, their single eyeshadows where you can put in the palette and they're magnetic and you can just switch them out, you know, they're not really magnetic, they just pop out, sorry, pop those out and then, you know, switch palette and it comes with a massive mirror. These eyeshadows are, I think they were, I will list the price across the screen, but at my drugstore, it was a very different price, but you know, you can find them so different. Sometimes you can find them a little bit up there. Not really up there, but what I mean by up there, like uh, above six bucks or less than three bucks. So that's basically affordable. So these are the shadows to sell. Ignore the red because the red, you don't want to have a real highlight, okay? Mm -mm. No, boo -boo. but if you do, hats off to you. But, anyways, these are the eyeshadows that I'm going to be. Focusing on today and talking to you guys about these eyeshadows are very great and I'm going to have like swatches in the video. See, look at these eyeshadows So Even the red looks great but look at these eyeshadows. Look how vibrant they look. Okay. So the eyeshadows that I'm going to be talking to you guys about. This is Genesis. Okay. This one. The one below Genesis. It's Universal Truth and then Tickle Me Over. So I'm just going to base off of Tickle Me Over Genesis and Universal Truth. And just if you guys want to which eyeshadow did this glow this. Okay, so then let's keep go ahead and get into the eyeshadows I want to talk about. It's coming from a company called Ruby Kisses. Ruby Kisses is found at any drugstore. You can find it on eBay, you can find it on Amazon. And you can just find Ruby Kiss actually anywhere. And that's the reason why I really, really love Ruby Kisses. And I'm highly a big fan of Ruby Kisses because they're not that brand where you have to just go to one spot and you don't see it in other spots. They're just like an all over brand. All over, I want to say US. But if they're in the UK area and you have any Ruby Kisses, let me know in the comments because that would be so neat. So this is the palette itself. I have a review already up on the channel. And I have a couple of shades that I want to talk about. Don't use the red because I'm pretty sure no one wants to use the red highlight. <laughs> but the other three shades is what I want to really base on. If you want more of a deep highlight but still look neutral and blend in at the same time. Then you would want to use Genesis. Genesis is a beautiful highlight shade and I want to swatch Genesis. So this is what Genesis looks like. It's like a gorgeous, it looks muddy but if you really work well with Genesis you can get a really great vibe from Genesis and I really really like Genesis because in photos if you use Genesis on your eyes or just on your I would say highlight area where you would do as far as your complete look. Genesis will look very great. And that's Genesis. Next we're going to talk about is Universal Truth which is the lightest one so far out of the colors. Universal Truth is very frosty. It intimidates me more than it intimidates Genesis because look how frosty that looks that looks frosty and you have to really be careful because of these eyeshadows they can appear to be a little bit chalky but it's a great outcome if you use them correctly 
Next, let's talk about is Tickle Me Over. Tickle Me Over is definitely my number one go to as far as highlight. I really, really love Tickle Me Over, and I'm just gonna swatch Tickle Me Over. It's kind of like next to Genesis a little bit. Okay, how am I gonna do this swatch? Okay. It's kind of like next to Genesis, and it kind of looks similar to Genesis, but it's more of your pinks and your pinks and peach category. Genesis is like more of your gold right out the bat, so then you have your deep reds, and I love it. I love it. It's just everything. So let's go ahead and get to the main part of this video, because which I'm so excited, you guys, like, so excited. So I'm just going to take an L brush. I love using a simple brush as a highlighter. And I'm just going to take, I want to test out a little bit of Genesis, which is this color here. I want to test out Genesis and see how Genesis will look on the nose. Not too bad. Not too bad I can get along with Genesis. But it, it's more noticeable. You know, like you got some highlighters that's not really, really noticeable, but they are there. But this is one of those ones. Next, I want to test out. I'm going to just go in with Tickle Me Over and use it as a high. Look how gorgeous Tickle Me Over is. Like, that's how I say I love. I just love and. Highly recommend Ruby Kisses eyeshadows. So dope. And then I'm going to highlight my chin. And then I'm going to highlight the center. The perimeter of the brows. And then the other perimeter of the brows. You know, have a highlighting party going on here so just look at Genesis and look at tickle me over Genesis is on the nose and tickle me over is on the cheeks the perimeter of the brows and then forehead and then chin but I want to tone down Genesis because it looks so like fake it reminds me of a fake highlight so I'm just going to take this massive brush from Claire's Cosmetics and I am going to just Tone it down, girl. Tone it all the way. You sometimes highlight on fleek can kind of take away a look. So don't get too excited with highlight because sometimes if you do too much highlight, the look won't be slayed. If you're trying to go for a slight look, so be on the lookout for that. You don't want to overdo your highlight. Just keep it simple have fun with it but at the same time remember you're gonna rock this look okay so here are the swatches and here's what it looks like on the you know face <laughs> so yeah I really, really love these eyeshadows as as a highlight shade I really like it. And if you guys are wondering how to get your hands on these palettes, and I'll have a link below. But yeah, I really, really love them. And plus, the other thing about these is, of course, if you've seen my review, they are magnetic. They pop out. So yeah. But these are really great affordable eyeshadows that can be used for a highlighter. Like, affordable, amazing, everything. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Give this video a massive thumbs up. Let me know in the comment section below what eyeshadows do you like to try to use, you know, to slay. You guys know, slay. And yeah, um, I gotta go and I'll see you soon. Bye.